fans, welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host Zila, and we are here today doing the Swamp Start scenario. You can see uh, off in the distance there that I have found what appears to be the patrol vessel platform uh with a couple of like defensive structures around it so let's go check this out first of all i'm going to change my field of view and i'm going to switch that down to 40 just to give me a little bit of a zoom in effect okay so now we're going to come in with our missiles we've still got our uh, rockets we still got over 200 so it appears to be three defensive bases so if we get right over top, we should be able to pop them. And we've got a range of 340. So we're going to come in. We might get some crossfire from the other side ones because we might not be too, we might not be far enough. So we'll see. 340, 340. Yeah, we're going to get shot at. Okay, we'll just back off really quick then. And did I get it? No. Darn. Did I get it? Yes. Okay. Well, I didn't get shot at by the other ones, so let's... Oops. Did not mean to try and eject. Got to keep our eye out for the patrol vessel, too. It might come around while we're doing this. And if that's the case, we really got to conserve our rockets. Just freak myself out thinking about that because it's probably sneaking up on us right now. Okay, so let's deal with these before they start shooting at us. Okay, so let's go over to this one and pop it. So we've got 340. Oops. Alright, there. Come straight down at it. Straight down. And one shot. Nice. That's why I like putting four rockets on because they can usually one shot a turret if you get it dead center. Okay, so now let's. Here, I know we're flying upside down. We'll just straighten out a bit for you guys. straight down so 340 340 and gone okay so those are neutralized let's deal with the drones so we're gonna switch to our uh, Gatling guns and we've got 289 289 we're looking for 289 Coming behind us here? No. Okay. So 289. 289. Okay. So there was something over here too, wasn't there? No. I can't remember if there's sentry guns on this thing. Okay, so I know there's spawners on that, so I'm not going to be popping the core, and I'm not going to land on it unless I take out the patrol vessel force first, so... I think we should loot. Now, are there Xerax patrols? I don't think the defenses count as being, they don't patrol those, but the the um, patrol vessel platform they may. I, and then we've got that that array over there, so okay. 
Let's just loot really quick here. Oh, something shooting at me. What's shooting at me? Oh yeah, we got, we got, we got guys. Okay. So, really? Green, glowy. <laughs> you die. Yeah, you do. Okay, so these guys, I want to shoot with my Gatlings, because I'll get XP for them. Okay, so there are Xerox around. So there are Xerox patrols. I'm thinking they are... I'm not sure if they're the patrol for the defense. They might be. I'm thinking they're more probably patrol vessel headquarter patrols. That have just wandered. Let's keep looking for patrols. Okay. Can we loot them then? I think we can. Let's try. Nice laser. I'm gonna need that stuff soon. I don't feel like spending Pentaxa to make it either. And to buy it, it's super expensive. What's well, a cobalt around? Okay, I just don't have the time to mess with the cobalt. Where is the other guy? I thought there was four of them. Didn't I kill four of them? Okay, let's get this minigun drone if we can. Okay. Okay, so we know that... You know what? I'm going to change my field of vision really quick here. Oops. Come on. Level out. back to 70 because I don't think we need it anymore. Okay. I'd rather have the peripheral vision seen below me. What's shooting at me. Okay. Can I get this one? Is there guys around? No? Okay. So let's try this. Awesome. Okay. Let's put that stuff away really quick. And that's all like. Okay. Oh, by the way, yeah, look how much I mined from that uh, asteroid. So we're doing awesome for fuel now. It's just heading back to the base when I ran across this. So. Figure this is where we're going to start this episode, right? Made sense to me. Got our heavy armor in there waiting for us. I'm excited about that. It's, it's, we're able to repair up our drills, which I broke both. Mining out the uh, Promethium. Okay. So we could, we could loot these defense ones. I think we should. So again, they have no spawners in them. So I, I don't care about me shooting the core out with a ship. And the core is just like exposed right there anyway. It's just begging to be shot out, right? So let's straighten out a bit. And we'll just shoot the core out. Okay. There's a dude. There's a dude. Yeah, there's more dudes in the around here. Okay. Whoa, buddy. That 
That was uncool. Shoot me in the butt like that. Huh. I think I need to deal with your friends too. I don't want them to shoot me while I jump out and loot ya. Okay. It is stopped. his buddies over here can I reach him probably not oh maybe bullets good bullets are good come on come on nice Ooh, laser upgrade kit laser ammo okay we can uh, since we popped the core on this let's just loot this really quick then oops Nice. Okay, let's go get the other defenses and then head back to base. So, the other thing too is the radar station, yeah, they're way over there. I came down um, <laughs> out of the, the orbit, like on the other side of the planet. There we, yeah, see, there's patrols. Okay, so... Whoa, 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 whoa. No tree in our own. Oh, look at them all everywhere. Okay. Okay, so this is... Uh, a lot more dangerous than we were expecting. Oh, would you stop that? See, they're just everywhere. What the heck? Okay, I have a feeling this is exactly what the um, what the radar station is going to be like too. Uh, I don't think we're going to be able to get an SV. We're not going to be able to park at a POI long enough to do the POI for the mission. Oops. Okay, that was some hor freaking little trees that's what's going on here really really leave me alone I hate those little freaking trees can't freaking see them yet they grab you once you're hooked on them you're screwed okay level 19 right on one more level see that's the other thing I want is I want level 20 Because I want certain things. Okay. Okay, can we loot these guys really quick? Don't see any over there. Okay, let's just lift it up a little bit. Level off. Jump out. Spawn the drone and get these guys looted up. Uh, drop our loot. Just got a full. Ah! They're despawning. Come on. Oh well. Okay. That's fine. Let's see if we can loot these guys really quick before they despawn. Come on. Stop that. I'm hoping for is yeah laser ammo that's what I'm that's what I'm looking for there he is come on come on come on come on nice okay excellent uh, 
let's just gain some altitude here. And where is the front door? Where is the front door? Is it right there? Yes, it is. Okay. Okay, we'll get this thing looted. Turning those into emergency rations. Okay. I mean, I guess I could put cores in these and take all the fuel, but I just got a ton of promethium. I'm more interested in just the ingots and the loot portion now. Uh, if I want to, I'll come back with an HV when I hit level 20 that can multi tool these down. So. Fuel's still there. I can get it later. Okay. Get that stuff put away. Say so that'll go in there too. Okay, we've got some stuff to go in the fridge. Excellent. And the rest is cargo. Let's see if we can fit anything in there. Yeah, no. Okay. Okay, good. Starting to get a lot of loot. Laser rifle. We don't have a lot of those yet, but. constructors Matt did we get any uh, thrusters from that we did didn't we we got a couple of small ones and two advanced constructors and a deconstructor yeah projectile turret a gravity generator and we still got a furnace so we're doing okay we got a bunch we bought those so we're actually doing pretty good we looted we've got more of those now wait didn't we have some in the other one Okay. Okay, just checking. I'm sure we're gonna have respawn shoot us any second here, so let's go check out the other one. So same thing, we'll just core it real quick here. Nope. Actually we'll shoot these guys real quick since they're gonna shoot us. Am I stuck on a tree? That was funny. I was actually, I was balanced pivoting on the tree. I didn't realize it. Discovered Comare. Comare? Where? Where? Oh, right there. Okay. That's fine. Okay. Is there anything around here that's going to shoot me if I loot these guys? Yes. Okay, so let's deal with them. Stop with the ammo missing thing. I don't know how they could be out of ammo at different times because they all shoot at the same frickin' time, and I reloaded them all at the same time last time. Anyway. <laughs> okay, uh, let's loot these guys. Let's loot these guys. We've got corpses all over the place with loot. Nice. I could do the, the 
uh, loot all button combo, but then you guys won't see what I'm actually looting. And I like to see too. It's like it, it makes it it's like instant gratification instead of instead of checking it out later on. Okay, so where were those guys? They were over here. Any more guys? Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Whoa! What was that? And who was shooting me? That sounded like a freaking laser dude right there. Okay. Up oh, on a tree again. I'm a tree hugger. Ah, uh, really? He shot me. Cause I'm freaking getting stuck on the tree right there. That was difficult. Okay. Ugh. Oh, look at all these guys. Holy crap. Die, die. They're hard to shoot. <laughs> they run around really erratically. Oh, more guys over there. Yeah, I don't, I don't remember. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Already? Dang, I'll go through ammo a lot. <laughs> With six guns. I'm thinking of removing the, uh, the ones in the middle of the nose, top and bottom ones. That'll still keep the, the, uh, the Gatling's widest and on slot one, but only have four of them at that point, because it's it might be overkill right now, and I'm, I think I'm going through a lot of ammo. Or maybe it's just some weirdness going on. Those guys coming in? No? 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 Okay. Okay, whatever. Oh, we're almost level 20. That's epic. Okay. So, let's kill more guys and loot those guys. And see, there's Xerax all over the place here. What am I hitting? The ground? Probably one of those twigs, you know, the indestructible Star Destroyer can't can't kill twig. Okay, let's just go down a bit here. We'll level out. Try and loot these guys. shoulder light with the drone but it usually has a better light than the shoulder light anyway so it's just kind of dark out right now yeah, let's try and get these guys before they despawn they're hot beverages and stuff when I throw all that in the uh, food processor it'll just turn all that into uh, um, into emergency rations for me so 
Yeah, they're useful now. They're uh, they're actually a good resource to find. Don't go through as much bugs. Hey, is that it? Is that it? Yeah. I could be grabbing all this cobalt, but I did find a bunch on the moon, and I got stacks of it. I keep looting stacks of it, so... I mean, I, I think we're pretty good on that right now. If we have to, we'll we'll uh, take an, an HE... We'll get an HV out with... Uh, you know, we're almost level 20. I want to hit level 20. Look at that. We're so close. What do we need? Uh, 3,000. Okay, so a couple of guys. A couple more guys. Couple more Xerox. Come on, where are you? Well, let's do the uh, minigun drones then, because they're seem to want to kill us. But why can't I target them? Okay, they were targeting me, but I couldn't target them. There we go. There we go. Is there guns on that? Okay, that's fine. So, I'm not too worried about their loot. Let's get this Defense 1 loot. And, well, you know what? We just need a couple more, right? Right, we're, we're, we're really close to leveling, right? Yep, yep, yep. So we can kill a couple of those critters and we'll level here. So let's do that. We'll loot this and head home. Oh, there's Xerox again. So here we go. Level 20. Woohoo! Oh, there is a door on that. There's a door on this one. Huh. No biggie. Shotgun, dude! That was shocking. Okay. Let's just level out here. We can just park for a second, jump out. Come on. Oh, really? Come on. I needed that extra little inch of jump. Oh, 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 oh. What are you doing, buddy? I think you need to die before we get shot by him. Where, where the heck was he? Right there. There we go. Okay. Get these guys before they despawn. Okay. Good, good, good. Oops. Little jittery there, I'm not sure why. The game isn't optimized yet, so it's still in alpha. Ooh, copper. That was nice. Okay. That was a good score. And we hit level 20. Uh, Comrade Patrol Vessel Headquarters, we will come back for it because those have spawners in them, so I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna do those right now. Uh, I just don't want to deal with all the ground troops that are spawning. And potentially take, damage our vehicles or something, so. We're gonna head back to base. 
so yeah this has been awesome and I will we will check out what we got got when we get back to base see you in a bit okay we're back at the base um, so I was looking at what we got it's actually pretty good we've got cargo box is just full 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 so I'm gonna put this downstairs and this stuff will all go I'm gonna I, I'm not gonna bore you guys but you know what I'm not gonna deconstruct this deconstructor because I'm pretty sure I want to put that out in space and make a space base that's solar powered to the extreme I was actually looking here and there's a couple of planets that well we can't oh that one will allow us to get to but there's a couple of more inner planets see this one over here we can't actually target lock so it's we're not allowed to go there from here so there's a lot of one-way uh, teleports to Ganja just like the other two starter planets only have one way out to uh, our one way ins from most stuff and and can only jump out to one or two planets so I just used I just shared the same one that um, the other planet you can't see it here it's it's somewhere over here anyway one of the other starting planets I just share the secondary planets with with this one with all the denies and everything so it all balances out um, well so I'm thinking one of these might be a really good planet to set up a space base on that one's the closest and can't target lock we can go there we can actually we could go there in the SB and check it out really so that's kind of cool. So that might be um, something worth checking out because if we can warp, if we can do it to somewhere we can warp with an SB around after that, that's kind of cool. Um, but we're still never, we got to get out. We, we need a, we need a CV to make some of these other big ones. Okay. Anyway, I was just checking to see where we might want to go next to check out for a possible base. But for now, I think we want to continue building this base. I have some pretty good plans for it, depending on how long it takes for Alpha 9 to come out. So um, I think we're going to. I don't think we're going to really go off planet, other than the Robson Protocol stuff. What what is going to happen with that and yeah I, I know I said we'd do that pretty quick here once I got all the armor and that but considering how many troops there are and and they're just going to blow up whatever we take there if I just leave it so only a CV and an HV are going to be appropriate to take there I think and we don't have really enough quite enough to do a good CV to go there but we can really beef up an HV, considering we're level 20 now. So let's take a look at the tree and really, really concentrate on the hover. We've got 300 points. We should be able to max out everything, pretty much freaking everything. So let's let's just do it. I want those jets. I want all this good stuff here. We'll take it all. Yep. Yeah, yummy, yummy, yummy. That's exactly what we want be building pretty quick here Ugh. wish there was take backs don't really need that single player derp a derp four points four points I could never get back I mean I can make when I'm level 25 I'll end up taking that anyway so it's it's a moot point who cares whatever four points wasted right now is not that big of a deal uh, I do want to take a plasma cannon and la laser rifle especially so that I can start taking making ammo. 
Okay. Uh, plasma cannon, probably not a bad idea. I can make enhanced rocket launchers now, so that's good. I think we're going to do that. I'm not, I, I don't think we're going to do the plasma cannons. I'm, I'm liking the, the rocket launchers, the T2 rocket launchers. Uh, they got the homing kick characteristic to it. It's it's actually more useful, I find, than the plasma cannons. Especially for stuff that's moving. <laughs> uh, sniper. Yeah, okay. That's fine. So we've pretty much unlocked all the weapons we can. What about the tools? The work lights. You know what? I, I wouldn't mind setting up some portable work lights, to tell you the truth, because... Oh yeah, fusion cell. Oh my god. I would have cried if I didn't take that. Flares, not so much. Okay, we got all the hover vessel stuff. I do kind of want to take the plasma cannon right now. So let's... Ooh, capital vessel stuff too, though. Uh, we know we're running out of points. Although I've taken a lot of the capital vessel stuff, haven't I? Not doing too bad, although I do need to, you know what, you know what, let's do this, because we need to take the rocket launchers pretty quick here, I think. Uh, the repair bay, repair console, let's do repair bay for the base, and then we'll eventually unlock the repair console. So that's base only, that's both. We'll put a repair bay up here, I think. We haven't looted one yet. Pretty much all the, all the POIs on this planet is just really uh, kind of like starter loot. It's, it's kind of creepy how it's such a hard planet with everything else, all the critters and all the, P, the other POIs, the combat POIs, but then Everything else is just like tons of villages with starter loot. And <laughs> kind of weird. Anyway, I'm not ranting. I mean, it's been it's been a lot easier to get stuff. I mean, I got tons of ingots now of the four basic ores. Plus, uh, oh God. Yeah, we should get this brewing up some fusion cells. So... We also want to get the furnace going on some of the stuff too, right? Well, I don't have a lot of don't have a lot of ore to smelt, but it'd be nice to get that furnace in there, and then we can be done with that. Uh, okay, so I don't have a lot of space left. Let's just put this away really quick here. Constructor. Uh, yeah, that one's fine. Put that in. And then the other one is my ammo one. I gotta mark those. Okay, so now I can get these fusion cells going. I should be able to make quite a few. Let's queue up like a hundred. I'm going to start frying up energy just, I'm going to start frying up like Prometheum to make Prometheum here because I'm going to drain the batteries on this base, doing a whole bunch of heavy construction for a bit. I might even have to put another, um, I probably will, you know, I'll probably put another fuel tank and another generator, up. another T2 fuel tank and another uh, small generator. And that should be fine for the furnace and uh, anything else that I need while, while it's out of solar power. Okay, so while that's using up my precious energy, we will continue to take all the crap out of this. So I want all this stuff because it's all yummy, yummy, yummy. Get it 
at all. Okay, I got a lot to unload. So you can see I got a bunch of stuff. What I'm gonna do, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna end, end the episode here. Clean up all my inventory, um, and I'm gonna start cooking up parts for an HV. And I want to make. I've already got plans uh, for a small little miner, and I don't need plans for a small miner. What I need plans for is a medium miner or a heavy miner, and I'm thinking a heavy miner. I've got the gear now. I should have, like, what are we at here? Well, we don't have a lot of sathium, do we? But we can get a whole bunch of these plates. And, I, yeah, we've got... Yeah, I'll be able to make I'll be able to make the the combat steel blocks for the HV. Hard steel plates of two steel. Oh yeah, so we can go we can go uh, put a. In the meantime, we can go get a whole bunch of those uh, plates by grabbing. You know what? I wonder if we can actually can we deconstruct. These? Can we deconstruct these for sathium? I've never actually tried. Have I? Can't remember now. Maybe. Uh. Anyway, we'll worry about that later. I can deconstruct these force fields even, but I might. I might have some use for the these because I'm pretty sure they will get rid of the uh, the nasty rain. So I might be able to make like a a nice covered construction area up here um, so I want to I want to do that and um, yeah I want to do that well here we are the sun's gonna start coming up any minute I feel that we have done pretty good. Um, our vehicle, this one is actually handling quite well. I'm going to put one more RCS in it. And I'm actually really happy with how it's performing. It took that face shot, a double face shot from a... Uh, I mean, sure, the thrusters are kind of tight together right in there with a, with a weapon too, so... I mean, hit that a couple of times and you're taking out a whole bunch of real critical parts on this side. But realistically, that does not cripple it. If you took out all of these thrusters right here, it would still fly. It wouldn't go sideways. It, it, it would still fly, not fly okay. It wouldn't be balanced. And it wouldn't go backwards as fast, but it would still fly okay. Um, and I'd still have a bunch of weapons still, so it's, I don't know. I think, I think it's okay. It's enough so that it would, that somebody would really, or they would, the enemy would really have to get lucky to cripple this thing completely. And pop all of the thrusters off the front, I think would be the only way of really crippling it. Which, which I guess isn't, isn't, uh, I mean, you know, four missiles will do that. Three even, I guess, if I took them right straight up the nose, I might lose everything. So, well guys, next episode, I'm going to have a bunch of parts cooked up for an HV. Um... Because I need I need a more versatile HV, something that we can maybe throw some thr some turrets on even, just a few turrets, not, not nothing crazy. But I want it to still be able to mine and mine well, and be balanced and be fast and but be a little bit bigger and more a little bit more full featured, uh, including the you know, maybe a cloning chamber, um, uh, although that's kind of crazy on a mining vessel, so, meh, I don't know, but the medic chamber, I, I, 
I mean, once I throw a cloning chamber and a medic chamber on there, it becomes like a little mobile hospital even. So if I, you know, it's, it's a good idea. It is a good idea. I think I really want to do that. And I hope in the future they make small size Xeno steel for vehicles for um, SVs and HVs because that would be awesome. I think I think Xeno steel for an SV would rock a little bit lighter and a little bit stronger. Something make these things just kick ass because right now uh, I couldn't I I couldn't really tank that thing at all. Those face shots were were just devastating. Uh, I mean, I did take it, but it's you know I guess I shouldn't be able to. Fine, okay. I took a couple of face shots direct and didn't survive, so I guess I should stop bitching. <laughs> <sighs> On that note, next episode we're gonna build at least get started. It might be a multi-episode like the SV, but, and you know what, you know what, right now, let's, let's name this thing, and I'll publish it, although, wait, hang on, we won't do that yet, let's, let's make a, uh, make an RCS for it, because we're going to pop one more RCS in, where are they? It's just a ton of crap in here now. HV, CV, SV. Okay, I think it just needs one more. Just to give it that just a little bit more. Without it being too twitchy. So it'll still be smooth without being too sluggish. So I think we're going to pop a hole right out of its butt here and stick it in its butt. Yeah. Let's do that. And then oh, we can't do it far up there. You know what? Let's uh, we'll remove a couple of these so we can get a better look. Yeah, see we can let's launch the drone and put it way forward so that we can get the weight better distributed. And then we'll replace these blocks and color them up, texture them. Although this is ugly as hell, I know, but it uh, it flies pretty well. I should put lights on it too. Yeah, you know what? I'll off camera. I'll finish. I'll finish this up. I'll put some lights on it. I'll finish painting it, and then I'll publish it. Um, don't know what to call it. We'll rename it right now. This is our, it's not swept wing, it's a delta wing. That was a delta wing, right? So we'll call this the, uh, Delta SV, hang on, hang on, hang on. Let's do, let's do this properly. SV Delta BT, the Delta BT box top, the Delta wing box top, the Delta BT. You know what? For now, that's going to work. Uh, yeah. Okay. What's its stats, anyway? Cobalt. Oh, well, uh, so it's pretty pricey. It's not cheap, guys. It's level 15. Because of the, uh, the rocket launchers. But there is nothing on it that's over a thousand ingots. So even the iron is under a thousand. Yeah, almost four hundred or almost five hundred cobalt is what the real limiter on this build is. 
You would think it would be the arrest rooms Ascosian, but the 164 shouldn't be too bad. The Cobalt might be difficult on, on like say the uh, the Akua type planet, or I don't know. You'd have to make like a little clap trap, fly to the moon, get the Cobalt. It's because it has those thruster jets which require Cobalt and the and the warp drive. Well, there we go. As the sun comes up. And graces us with its beauty on this overcast day, with the sun coming through the the clouds there in beams. We'll look out over our future mountaintop domain, because. Once I get this all built up, we won't be going below that much. Well, I won't say that. I won't say that. I, I've got some plans for this. This is not going to look like this when we're done. If I have my way. Okay, guys. Next episode. Big HV build. Till then, you guys have yourselves an awesome, awesome day.